Magic Squad. This is Serpy. Now, today I'm going to talk about the fact that Jamaica has produced some of the most flamboyant criminals you'll ever see anywhere. When you really think about it, it highlights the fact that the government, the security forces, really been dropping the ball and continue to do so. Why am I saying that? Because their money shouldn't be hard to catch. Jamaican criminals, especially the 87s and I would say most 90s, are some of the most video light hungry criminals you'll find anywhere. When you watch the documentaries or you watch the movies or you read the books about various groups from all over the world, you will see that they try to stay in the dark. Because when you're a criminal, that's the only way you stick around longer. Not Jamaican criminals. At least not 87s and 90s. You see, Jamaican criminals, Jamaican 87s, Jamaican 90s, they want to be done, they want to be shatter. But at the same time, they want you if you know say them are shatter. They want you if you know say them are done. And then to make things worse, some of them take on side job. Some of them take on part-time work while being dons, while being 87s. You know like how somebody would be, right? for example, a teacher, and then they might sell some fruits on the side to help supplement their income. Jamaica is a place where you have a man where is a Dan, but on the side, he's an entertainer, he's an actual socialite, he's in the mix. When the dancer keep and the cameraman are going and the lights are shining, he's all up, enjoying the limelight, confused. To make a place where a man can be a talented dancer and a gunman at the exact same time. Yeah. Now we can start to the examples. But the poster child, if you're confused, Chacha Boy, Slash Dan, Slash Entertainer, Slash Dancer, what a hundred slash the I can get, I'm mean, not talking about the knife. I'm talking about none other than William Moore, aka William God. William God is the poster child for a confused Jamaican Don. This was a brother way. On any given night, can play any given role. You might book him up in a Don mode. And he want to thump out everything to their mouth, make him dogs in Russia. At the time, Black Roses was obviously much stronger than they are now or whatever is left of it now. Another night, you might catch him. And he's a big dancer. He might boggle and control the dance floor. Another night, you catch him. He might be a cha cha boy. For example, check out this old picture of William Gott. I know most people never see this yet. The man looks like he spent about 4 hours a day in the ear salon. But on the Agatha alone, Black Rose is crew in general. It's like the man them, they have some kind of special contract. Like they get like a sponsorship deal with a cream ear company. When they say Rose's man them pull up, Looking like slick back the pimp. You might see one of the man them, theme shirt, front roll up, navel ashore. It was very spooky. Very spooky. Enough people never too sure how I go on, and enough people they want to say something, but remember at the time this was Black Roses in the peak of them strength. This was when. 
I got them now itch for step in the man. Money and run, man. machine buy up, man. politics link. Man. So enough people they want to say something, I have to whisper it. But the thing, they look spooky. But I don't know if I buy design or by accident. Somehow, we have got Bogle, Black Roses, managed to build one of the strongest brands in a dance hall. The Black Roses brand actually travel across the world. The name Roses Corner starts spread far and wide. People are flying for go see what's so special about this Roses Corner. But enough people they think it was just an entertainment group. People see the dancing, people see the lifestyle, and they never know. There was an uglier side to the whole thing. And Willie Agar never left the ugly side alone which is a trademark of a 90 octane while a 116 when them immediately start a transition distance themselves from the ugly side they don't want to be known as a Dan they don't want Dan ship attached to them name they don't want badness attached to them name they don't even want nobody afraid of them the 90 Will always remind you, say, and him run after corner you. Will always remind you, say, him can make things happen to you. Him can make people hurt you. He tell you that himself. So now, Rose is in a situation where daytime, when sun is shine, bad news. Nighttime, partying, and fun. Now, Sankey can sing so. Only, well not only, but mainly Jamaicans, Trini, uh, Guyanese, and St. Vincent, right? place like that. Yes, a man who try have them badness cake and eat it too. Man want to live both lifestyles. Man want be able to inflict damage on people and then comfortably walk on the road at night time and go have them fun in a party. Man want to be the underground shadow world kingpin, but be famous at the same time. Jamaican dance are confusing, and their overexposure is one of the reasons why their enemies can get to them so easy. And the same overexposure is why, not for the one they marine for a long time, right, should have been scraped up off of the road by the security forces. Because they money now hide. Jamaica is a place where Dons have done in them name. Dons have done in them name. It can't get no easier than that. Them, they, half of the police work done for them already, and they can't be a like case. Well, let me tell you back, they don't want to be a like case. Because they can. So, Black Rose's crew. Not just really a guard, but even Ice, you, you might have seen me video on Ice. Another individual who was very confused. Dancer and bad man at the same time. The man in our position where them can step out right, of the badness. Because remember, one of the arguments is well, we expect them now no money. By that reasoning, after we did lick it big. Black Roses, Roses Corner, should have been a bastion right, of peace and security. Willie Agard should have become a humanitarian because now he had no more money issues. In his day, Willie Agard was one of the most liquid right, cash, right about uh, liquid cash, dance in the streets. Even them time enough down there for rely upon hand out and links and on a government contract. Willie Agard was independently rich because they know them lick it big. You know the Americans said you caught a lick. 
we like got them, they were bag of money. But when I'm telling you about money, you just amplify who you already is. So we like got was already. No one for a big ego. So when the money roll out and the money get enough for, I got ego got even bigger. Him even faster for punch through the teeth them now. He must have one style, he love to tell people. Make it taste the diamond. Have a ring, a diamond ring. So he said taste the diamond, obviously. He don't take a uh, he doesn't take a man who specialized in a quantum physics, you know, same attack, right? thumping him out. Go party. If if they, if they pull up somewhere and they like this party they didn't get for park, the man will park them will get this. If they walk going to the party and the guard up on the gate, tell them say for wait I sir, I don't go in it, wait till or you need to do this. And then feel like say the guard not acknowledge them, thump in the face, kick up. Very confusing. Why they man can't make up their mind with them want be celebrities, socialites, or being a badness? No for them are probably better off just sticking to them entertainment. Sticking to having them fun and making them money. But you see the badness element to it is what really gives you the credibility in Jamaica because Jamaica is a city culture need badness right, to truly get a man in quote unquote ratings. Right. In other parties, in the streets, the man will have reputation, have a badness reputation attached to him. There are certain perks that come in that. That open up the doors. Right. Watch the reasoning I give you now. I show no Jamaica culture acidic. You have two men. All things equal. Two of them make five million dollars a year. Two of them drive a Bima. Two of them live a uh, Jacksil. Same size house right beside each other. One of them making money from being, I don't know, he's he's the best architect in the country. The next man, he must have everything the next man have, but he run off on corner, run a jungle. You see the man with all the differences, he run off on corner, run a jungle. In Jamaica, that man have more respect and opportunities. Men want to be him, kerosene want to be with him. You see the architect, only maybe lean front start to drip like a water commission pipe when you see him. Only maybe lean. But you see, for example, the Haggard. Haggard can get not just carry, but also maybe lean. Yes, maybe lean will double and double. Cause I hear about the bad man. I wonder what it's like. I wonder what it's like. Let me just smell like one time. Then when she realized that a 15 woman, then she said, Oh, this is not the life for me. And then she gone back to Carlton. And she gone back to the architect. But the doors open. More doors open in Jamaica, the city culture. When badness attached to your name. You walk in more places and get more ratings and the youths them see that. So the youths them attach the badness even though they have money and luxury. Right? And then can leave badness alone, they still left it alone. They still not left it. That's a different level of clout. It's a different level of admiration. So I saw them end up become these confused done slash entertainer slash businessman right? slash artist a hundred slash one of my main objectives is by the time we finish with this youtube thing however 
waiting people really understand the culture element to badness in Jamaica the culture element to make are you to even if you start out like Willie really Agard right? and then you know in the already our name in the streets and then up get money and then character and another level of acidity this youth would actually be a Carlton make a bag of money and then start be a Willie Agard Jamaica is a place where man go from being Carlton to gunman. Once him now have the power to do so. What is drawing people who don't even originally start off as a bad man in a badness? Culture. Because them see the ratings that come from being a bad man in Jamaica, that come from being a quote-unquote Dan. People can see Carlton stand up and watch and see who get the most hype and the most strength and the most girls. And Carlton, even though inherently a good youth, if you ever get the means to start can recruit some 87s around him, next thing you know Carlton take up badness. At the age of 39, them kind of foolish, you say. Notice in a city cultures like Jamaica, Trinidad, in America, in the hood. Man, live their whole life, right? law abiding citizen, get a bus, and next thing you see him start a the gun, man. Have you ever seen that? Would have make sense? Man, I get. Reputation of being a criminal after him reach, after him do his masters, something can go so. After him get him PhD, him end up right persons of interest. The culture don't just draw youths to it, but it make, it make them and them already night no one left. And worst of all, it make young youths aspire to do the same thing. Because throughout all this madness, when we talk about, you know, the Carlton and, you know, the j and the Kerosene and the Maybelline and we say Carlton, I watch how j get treated. You know who else I watch? The 13 year old youth. The 14 year old youth. The youth to reach the age where I'm old enough now for lock gun and can go for apps. And him can either go this direction or that direction. And him sit down on him corner. And him a watch. And him a study. And him notice that them mania get all the ratings. Them mania get all the kerosene. And some of the Maybellines. And them mania over here so. He look if he can find one Maybelline. So who do you think the youths them are going to aspire to be like? Who do you think young impressionable youth are going to aspire to be like? You might want to be really a god. Remember, there's no such thing as a Carlton Bunks. Whoever say, tell me in the comment section, has anybody ever seen a Carlton Bunks? Have you ever seen a dance there? Carlton Bunks? Have you ever done the Carlton Bunks? Nobody know how to do that. A dance too clean cut. A dance too, too law abiding. A willy bounce the thing there. Young youth has said, hold well, on. Not only the Dan get the pick of the kerosene. Not only the Dan get for walking at the party and the selector say, oh, big up the Dan. Willy, big up the, the Black Roses crew. Dan a music video a dance. Dan even have a dance named Half Time. Right. Even when the Dan gone, his name still live on because that dance is immortal. You would see that. That's what you would want. Recognition. Respect. You would want to be the man. The man go somewhere right, and people treat them 
like them are smuddy. And when them look round, and them see who get treated like smuddy. When them hear who for name a call in a song, them never hear a call tan. They never hear a song say, Simon I want Danny if I know him a call tan. Have you ever heard that song? Send me that song there. The song was say, Simon I want Danny if I know him a call tan. Send me it. You've never heard that song yet. You've never heard that song. Youths here. Big up. These girls are not girls. I notice when their favorite entertainers them are big up. Inner city. Notice them only. Shout out the one they have enough violence. Then the shout out the poor communities them were peaceful enough. Just think about it. Since you know, cause you know they, they love the poor and all that, you think them would say big up the, the poor because we know the poorest places them in Jamaica. Right. I know the name you know, people love call. The poorest places them in Jamaica. You find it. Portland, for example, is one of the poorest places in Jamaica. Right. The parish as a whole. You have rich people down there, but as a whole, when you measure uh, income, standard of living. Many of Jamaica the rural communities are some of the poorest places in Jamaica. You listen to the young people? When man big up, who them big up? Big up TG Jungle Southside, Matches Lane. Only the bad man place them. You'd see that. I usually come from an inner city where peaceful. I get looked down and I diss, but you take come from an inner city. We're violent. When I make him know, say, you don't come from bad man place. Where you come from? A joke place that. Do you have anybody dead on this? A three man dead last week in my place. That's a brag in Jamaica. That's culture. That's culture. So no wonder. 87s confused. 90s confused. Because the whole of Jamaica confused. For me, I say, Jamaicans don't know where we want to be. I mean, we say we want a peaceful society, crime free. We say that, but all that we do. We say you would stay up on the right path and keep your head up high, but that's not who we elevate. That's not who we big up. That's not who the girls in my lineup for reproduce with. Let's be honest. As you can see, the video is really, again, Touching on the whole culture thing. Just use Willie Cart and Black Rose as an example. But culture, any society will feel if you understand it. I understand how important it is. In my opinion, it's doomed. Because people can deal with things that they see, the, the tangible things them. But culture is invisible, yet so powerful. Simon, I got to tell you, say, well, because culture is not something you can measure, for example, like GDP growth, right, or for example, the crime rate, you can watch them things and measure them. You can't really measure culture, so because of that, enough people just ignore it. Well, from day one, I've always been pushing the culture. And culture encompass all other things. I did say that. Anyway, Patreon squad, big up on yourself. PIA, I don't know, more life. Vulture squad, stay circling. Bless.